of self-discipline changed my life, and it will change yours as well. By continually demanding more from myself, I became successful in sales and then in management. I caught up on my schooling and took an MBA degree in my 30s, which required thousands of hours of determined study. I imported Suzuki vehicles into Canada before anyone else, set up 65 dealerships, and sold $25 million worth of the vehicles. And this is all after I had started with no knowledge of the industry. What I had, however, was the discipline and determination to learn what I needed to know and then to apply and do what I needed to do. I got into real estate development with no knowledge or experience, applied the power of discipline, which was then backed by hundreds of hours of work and study. I then went on to build shopping centers, industrial parks, office buildings, and residential subdivisions. With self-discipline, I have built successful businesses in training, consulting, speaking, writing, recording, and distribution. My audio and video programs, books, seminars, and training programs have sold more than $500 million worth in 36 languages in 54 countries. Over the years, I've consulted for more than a thousand companies and trained more than 5 million people in live seminars and talks. In every case, the practice of self-discipline has been essential to my success. I discovered that you can achieve almost any goal you set for yourself if you have the discipline to pay the price to do what you need to do and to never give up. So who should read this book? This book is written for ambitious, determined men and women who want to achieve everything that is possible for them in life. It is written for people who are hungry to do more, to have more, and to be more than they ever have been before. Perhaps the most important insight of all with regard to success is that to achieve greatly, you must become a different person. It is not the material things you accomplish or acquire that matter so much as it is the quality of the person that you must become to accomplish well above the average. The development of self-discipline is the high road that makes everything possible for you. This book will serve as your step-by-step guide to becoming a remarkable person who is capable of making remarkable achievements. A chance encounter reveals the reason for success. Some years ago, I was attending a conference in Washington, D.C. During the lunch break, I was eating at a nearby food fair. The area was crowded, so I sat down at the last open table by myself, even though it was a table for four. A few minutes later, an older gentleman and a younger woman who appeared to be his assistant came along, carrying trays of food and obviously looking for a place to sit. Having lots of room at my table, I immediately arose and invited the older gentleman to join me. He was hesitant, but I insisted. Finally, he sat down quite thankfully, and we began to chat over lunch. It turned out that his name was Kopp Koppmeyer. As it happened, I immediately knew who he was. He was a legend in the field of success and achievement. Kopp Koppmeyer had written four best-selling books, each of which contained 250 success principles that he had derived from more than 50 years of research and study. I had read all four books from cover to cover, each more than once. After we had chatted for a while, I asked him the question that many people in this situation would ask. Of all the 1,000 success principles that you have discovered, which do you think is the most important? He smiled at me with a twinkle in his eye, as if he had been asked this question many times, and he replied without hesitating. The most important success principle of all was stated by Albert Hubbard, one of the most prolific writers in American history at the beginning of the 20th century. He said, self-discipline is the ability to do what you should do, when you should do it, whether you feel like it or not. He went on to say, there are 999 other success principles that I have found in my reading and experience, but without self-discipline, none of them work. With self-discipline, they all work. Thus, self-discipline is the key to personal greatness. It's the magic quality that opens all doors for you and makes everything else possible. With self-discipline, the average person can rise as far and as fast as his talents and intelligence can take him. But without self-discipline, a person with every blessing of background, education, and opportunity will seldom rise above mediocrity. Your two worst enemies Just as self-discipline is the key to success, the lack of self-discipline is the major cause of failure, frustration, underachievement, and unhappiness.